The Washington County School District is celebrating after receiving the largest grant in the state from the Department of Justice's Office of Community Oriented Policing Services School Violence Prevention Program. The district is getting half a million dollars, which as News 13's Emily McLeod tells us came as quite a shock once they heard they were awarded the full amount. Kimberly Register, the safety director for Washington County Schools, says being awarded a grant of half a million dollars is a huge accomplishment for the district. It was an accomplishment. It was, it was a big shock, but you know, I, I've always gone into things saying that if we don't apply for it, we're never going to get it. Register says because the district isn't that large and only has around 3,400 students, it makes it harder for the district to get more resources to upgrade their schools. We still have schools and we still have safety measures that we have to put in place and it doesn't matter how small your school district is, those things still have to happen. Washington County Superintendent Joe Taylor says their first priority is to make all of their schools have only one entry point. He says this is a new requirement set by the state. So our goal is to do that. That'll involve fencing and the single point as far as remodeling of some of the offices to make certain we can do that. School board officials say the half million dollars awarded to them will now expedite their plan to put these safety measures into place. I, I really think that we would have been outwards to five to ten years to get everything in place with the financial resources that come to a small district based on FTE allocations. This is going to allow us to accelerate the plan that we had in place already. So it, it's a game changer for us. In Washington County, Emily McLeod, News 13, Panhandle Strong.